Hey YouTube, this is Super Zemis and Bacheesley back in action. And we welcome you back to Let's Play Kirby 64. The Crystal Shards. Whoa! Gosh, it, sorry it's been a while since I got Bacheesley in. I mean, with the new computer, I'm back from vacation. It all worked out eventually, so... Anyway, let's get started here. I'm gonna have Bacheezy take on this boss, because I took on Arco last time. We'll switch off with bosses, so Bacheezy, you do the honors. Alright, let's see what we can do. Alright, uh, gonna hit the right button. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, all the... Just because it's a new computer, all the controls are still the same, though. That's good. Alright, all there's a little lag, sorry about that. Alright, jump, 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 run! Oh crap! I've been I've been uh, I've been wounded. That's only one health. Okay, watch out. Go. Okay, here he comes. Ooh. Ow! Not your day today. This is not my day. No, it is not. It's like the Arco incident. Oh, it's a good thing we got. Holy crap! Oh. Don't worry. Don't worry. That was good for my wit. Okay. Get it. And jump on the one that's been. Okay. Alright, you got it. Wait, what's wrong? The music's still going. Uh-oh. Oh dear, what is going on? Probably want to get out of there. Can't damage him until... Oh yeah, I forgot about yeah. that. You can't damage him until the battle starts again. Anyway. Oop. Go. And again. Right. I like it the long range because you don't need to worry about um, getting hurt, basically. I, I, that's why I like the long range in this battle. The best weapons, to, well, the best abilities, Kirby abilities to use. Oh crap, run, run, no! I hate that ability. Ow. Ow. It's like you can't dodge it. No, you can't. You almost got him, though. That's why I like long range in this battle, though, because you don't need to worry about his short range attacks. The one like he goes he's made from. of lava. You don't want to touch that. No, well, that would be bad. You want to get his face. Oh, I want to get his face. Yeah. There we go. Like that. Simple enough. Hard boss if you don't have long range abilities. I played this boss with the bomb shuriken. Just crushed him. Yeah. Bomb shuriken's amazing, especially when you're fa my favorite. Alright, so we're all staring at I hear an crystal. earthquake. Or feel an earthquake. Oh, no, it's not an earthquake, it's a VOLCANO! Run! Run away! Run away! I gotta catch up! Oh, no, Ronald, you gotta catch up! Uh-oh. Don't eat him, Kirby! Jeez, I knew you were hungry always, but I didn't know you would resort to cannibalism. I know you're hungry, but this is ridiculous. Alright. So I don't think that's cannibalism, though, unless it's, you know, Kirby... Oh, Waddle Kirby's. D has the same flush as him. Anyway. Yeah, let's change the subject. Yeah, changing subject. Anyway, here we are in Shiver Star. This is actually... Wait, before you... I want to talk about Shiver Star. The rumors about it. Yeah, I don't think this is proven yet. Anyway, this Shiver Star, if you haven't told yet, pretty obvious it's the ice level of the game. And... That's odd. There's... Earth has one moon, right? It does. Do you see Australia in there? I see North, North and South America. What are these three... Greenland? Are Is those, that are Africa? Those, are these continents? What the? I don't think this is true or not. It should be. The evidence is pretty uh, pretty good, but Shiver Star might be post-apocalyptic Earth. Hence why it's cold. Very cold. I mean, it makes sense, though. I mean, it look at the, ev sense. the evidence. One moon, Australia, North and South America there. You know, this kind of this kind of stinks. We're all gonna be dead when Kirby actually exists. Nuts. <laughs> anyway, what, what was I gonna say? Honestly, Shiver Star, I think Kirby levels do ice levels very well. They do. In my opinion, they do very well. This is probably my favorite star in the game, favorite level. And oh yeah, let's uh, we're gonna switch off now. Okay, let's. Get, oh, we'll be right back. Alrighty, we're back now, and let's get started with Shiver Star. I'll be playing this level. You know, because everyone loves winter. Yeah. 
Anyway, let's get rid of Rock and Lightning being an ice level. I want to show off. I haven't really shown off much with um, ice. Um, I don't really like... Ah, um... oh, I'm not saying missed. Anyway, I think I've already shown off the needle and ice, which is basically a snowflake. As... Here we go, right here. As, um... Rock and Cutter's your fun ability, Ice and Bomb is my fun ability. Why? You're basically a running snowman bomb. Doesn't really work very well. Kamikaze snowman! Basically, I don't really like it that well. That's one of my fun abilities. Like, ice, uh, Rock and Cutter's your fun ability. It is indeed. I do is. like, what I do like, if I can just... There we go. Double ice. Giant snowball. The situation is snowballing out of control. Ooh. Anyway, yeah, it's just like that comical uh, Saturday Saturday morning cartoons that you watch where you're basically a giant. You trip, start rolling into a snowball. You know, I love those. Those were great. Yeah, you could just roll through the entire level, just take up everything with you. At the very end of the screen, wait for it. For Boom! Effect. Explosion! Unfortunately, though, we can't really use it that often in the other screens, but because, well, this is what you're doing. That cake, though. There go. Doesn't make sense. You're low on health. Yeah. You know, cake actually sounds good right now. Like but, literally. But we are doing an LP for you. We don't eat cake in an LP. No, we do not. We can't really eat an LP either. We can drink water. Water brought to you by the Earth. Oh, this part. I love this part. Waddle Dee. Come on, you don't just smack me. In the rear. In the tushy. You just kick the my tuchus. butt. The tuchus. The tuchus. Anyway, let's get rid of all these guys. All these losers. Watch out for the, um wood tree stumps now when we get to the second snow dome or the second igloo whatever you want to call it yeah we actually want to jump over it to get a crystal shard i don't know super zemis that's kind of insane it worked didn't it it did <laughs> that's the main point of kirby you have to be insane sometimes oh yeah like getting crushed by well Rolling into a giant. You know, fire we'll fight fire with fire? Let's fight ice with ice. Sounds like a perfect idea. Boom. Now, if you had fi double fire, you can get this crystal shard. That's how you get that. Yeah, I know. It's just like um the last level in Neo Star. You would have never guessed double ice to get rid uh, to get that crystal shard. Uh, wait for it. Go! Alright. Now, there's some cracks where you can go into the water. I don't want to go into them until I get to the third crack. You know, one of my favorite power-ups in this level is is uh, Cutter and Ice, which is uh, figure skating. Oh yeah, that one's real fun. That's I like fun. that one. That's fun. Anyway, here's the third crack in the... Watch out for the giant golem spike thing. I don't even know what that's called. Is it a golem? I don't know. Mm. Alright. Yeah, that ice guy on top of the ice can't get you, but if you go through that third crack, go through that dome, you get a crystal shard. Woo! Sparkly. Getting a bunch of them. Sparkly. <laughs> Sparkly. Sparkly. Oh, crap. Whoa! Ah, great. This guy's gonna want to get me. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take the damage because I wouldn't be able to get out without him attacking me. Well, I would know no other way. Well, what you could have done is you could have released your double ice power, held it above your head, and swum up. Uh, yeah, but you would have fell through the water. Yeah, but you would have killed him and then just swam back up. Yeah, that is true. Oh well. We get some more food, so why not? We, we get food. And here we are with the situation snowballing out of control. LOL. Yeah. Well, you want to watch out. This, what is this thing? 
You die. A rejected Muppet? Yeah, yeah, that seems about right. Crap! Squish! See, he doesn't like you, because he was sad that he got rejected. By the Muppets. You know, playing Kirby, this game is actually making me a little hungry. It is, isn't it? Once in a while, if you play enough Kirby, you can actually get hungry from playing it. Well, I mean, there's all this food hanging around. And yeah, every, I'm actually getting a little hungry right every now. Every cutscene usually is him eating something. Or consists of him eating something, or whatever you want. You know, it. it deals with food somehow. Yeah. Alright, jump! These you wanna guys, watch out for these guys. They're yeah, gonna he, eat you if you... Jump! These guys are like it. those uh, little beetle things in the last Two or three levels. The ant lions. Yep, a rock, come out rock they, star, that's it. Yep, and they would come out and they would try and cut you. Well, these guys would eat you instead. But, the good thing about it, if uh, certain abilities, you can kill them. Really? Not the rock star ones, but these ones, yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Like, what abilities, Super Zemus? Uh, Bomb and Cutterkin. Ah. I think I'm gonna miss this one. Yeah, I missed it. That was a sad attempt. Ha! That was actually a pretty good pun. <laughs> I'm victorious. Anyway, how cold is it gonna get here? And what other evidence is that that this is a post-apocalyptic Earth? Find out next time on Let's Play Kirby 64. The Crystal Shards. This is Super Zemus. And the cheesy. And we'll see you guys next time. Have a good, good one. one. Ba da ba 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 ba